Police say they have strong leads in the case of a man accused of using candy to lure children into his car. Someone jotted down the driver's tag number after children refused to take the bait as they waited at a bus stop near Hill Street and Woodward Avenue. Channel 2's Tom Jones is live in southeast Atlanta, where police say the man tried to do his dirty work. That's right, Monica. Child molesters know this stuff makes kids do what they were told not to do, and that's get in the car with strangers. Someone tried that here, and it didn't work. Also didn't work when I tried it with a second grader. If I offered you some of this and told you to get in the car with me, would you? No. No matter how hard I tried. But, Robert, I got some candy. What if I wanted to give you some candy and tell you to get in the car with me? I wouldn't do it. Second grader Robert Reese wouldn't accept my candy in exchange for him getting in the car with me, a total stranger. If you don't know, you shouldn't get in the car with him. Other children in this area seem to have learned that lesson as well. Police say a man driving a beige or gray Nissan Altima tried two different times to get children at bus stops to get in his car. One time he offered candy if they got in. No one took the bait and the man drove off. The attempted abduction has parents here upset. He need to get his tag number. Someone jotted down the man's tag number. Police say that gave them strong leads in this case. Meanwhile, Robert's mother says this is why she walks Robert to and from school. We got a lot of sick people out in the world, and it's just getting worse. Robert wanted to let other kids know how serious this is. Look, if y'all watching, never go and get candy for a stranger because this is coming out from my mouth. Because if you get candy from a stranger you don't know, they might try to get you in the car and get, take you for hostage or something. Yeah, good advice. Police say that man is 160 pounds, stands six feet. He's a light-skinned African-American man. The Georgia tag on that gray or, or beige Nissan Altima is BBL7498. Contact police if you have any information. We're live in Southeast Atlanta. Tom Jones, Channel 2 Action News.